Hey guys, my name is Lazarus, and welcome back to Whistleblower DLC from Outlast. This is gonna be great. This is gonna be great. It's the spooky, scary stuff, and we're gonna deal with it together. And it's gonna be just the best thing. It's gonna be the best thing for our relationship. Just gonna close that door. Get on the floor. I'm not security. I was. I'm a patient like you. Stole these clothes from a dead body I found. You gotta get me out of here, please. Just push the button. Open the door. Okay, I'll push the button. Ugh. You're welcome. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Oh, that is unneededly brutal. Do it again. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're a nice guy. You do what I ask you. I'll remember that. I'd never seen a man die before today. Never seen a dead body outside of a coffin. Dozens today. Murdered and worse. I looked into one man's eyes as another torn to pieces. He, he, he smashed his head against the wall. It wasn't, it wasn't torn to pieces. Claimed he was a doctor, then saw the rags they've dressed me in and changed the story. Said he was a patient. Could have been either. They're all crazy. All sick. No real difference between them now. The therapy is spreading. And what am I? I watched his men die and only thought, it's not me. Thank God. I know that someday, I don't want to be murdered. Well, I think everybody can get behind that thinking. We need to go to that airlock. Where is it? Never mind, I'm stupid. Right here. <laughs> oh, hey, dead guy. <sighs> okay. Where you guys going? Hey, hey, wait, wait, wait. You going outside? Let me go, let me go. No! No, you slut mags! Shit. I'm not one of them, though. I'm a good guy. I also got another battery, but that's besides the point. Document. Miss Grant, you may receive requests for information from Miss Lisa Park of Leadville, Colorado, in the coming weeks concerning the resignation and hospitalization of her husband, Waylon. If so, please forward them to my personal attention. Waylon Park resigned due to previously undiagnosed mental illness. I personally visited Mrs. B. Lisa Park and her sons and broke the news to them, with the silver lining that Murkoff Psychiatric would be graciously providing treatment. Mrs. Park had some less than terrible things to say about myself and the Murkoff Corporation. I assured her that with her power of attorney, she could try to fight the doctor's diagnosis of her husband's illness. However, if it was discovered that he resigned under false pretenses, his insurance would be cancelled and the family would be saddled with not, not insignificant health care debt. Hopefully, she understood. What if she insists on making a nuisance of herself? Or she has to get around on me? Please let me know. This is one I want to take care of personally. Yours, Jeremy Black. Bitch, you're not gonna kill my wife and my kids. They didn't do nothing to deserve that shit. Shit. Okay, can't go through there. There must be something I can do here. There has to be. For science, for America. Aha. Can I climb on you? Yes, I can. I totally can. Okay, this is slowly and slowly becoming more and more interesting, and I, uh, don't know how to feel about it. Uh, let's go in here. Alright, this is good. Totally not gonna die. <laughs> don't be crazy. Jesus. Oh god. Oh, it's the ice truck killer. Look into my eyes, bitch. Okay. This is slowly Oh. Oh good. Good. You know you know what? You know what? I'm happy about this. We're gonna have a nice meal tonight. By the light of the blue fire. It's gonna be perfect. Oh god. Uh oh, dead people. Okay. Are these all people he's eaten? Can I please leave that way? No? Okay. I don't wanna go over there. Ah shit! 
uh, did his head just explode? Oh my god! Don't look at us. Hey. I love him. Calm your shit, buddy. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, oh, brutal! Oh, Ugh! oh, je oh, Jesus Christ! Many Lord in heaven! Oh my God! He's just sitting there nomming on that man. Oh my God! What are you? What is wrong with you? What the fuck, dude? Okay, I've seen enough here. Um, you enjoy your meal, and I'll uh, I'll be on my way. Okay, okay. I want to get the fuck out of this place. I just, I just want to go. I mean, if that's okay with you guys, I'm just gonna leave. Oh boy. What? Unlock the handcuffs to open the door. Okay, I don't have the keys. Who the fuck locks a door with handcuffs? That's ridiculous. Oh. I have to... Something bad's gonna be here. I don't want to deal with this right now. Oh god, okay. Fuck it, let's just do it. Oh. He's following me. Okay. Um. Oh, we just need to go. Okay. See you later, buddy boy. I will be having none of that soup right now. Oh, he's coming. Everybody just be really quiet. He can't get us. Oh god, this is tense. He's right there. Shh! No, you shush. Okay. Okay, I think we're safe, moderately. Okay, he's over there. Where the fuck do I need to go? Oh! Go! Okay, we're good. Oh. Okay, we might be safe for like another minute. We need to go now. Though. Oh! I don't want you to tell me a secret. I'd rather you not do that. Uh, just keep your distance, buddy. I can't fire upon you, but I will not be a happy camper if you continue on the path of non-righteousness that you are uh, currently on. Okay. Whew. Okay, this is, um... This is pretty intense, and I like it. Hey, look, that's a spine. That's a, that's a, that's a, that's a spine. Thingy! Yeah. At the time of Miss Cho's termination, the, psych the psychosomatic effects of the morphinic engine on female employees and patients had been well established. Already more than several female employees and patients had reached fictitious half-term pregnancies in a matter of weeks before miscarrying the non-existent child, five of them fatally. Well, that's just depressing. Female employees were moved to higher floors in the facility, then to other buildings, and eventually entirely off the Mount Massive facility. The critical secrecy of Project Wallrider necessitated secrecy and, and the motivating factor 
For the reassignments and terminators resulting in a perceived injustice from several terminated parties, Ms. Cho has succeeded in acquiring a court order FOIA release of the documents surrounding her termination. Those documents will need to be generated and post-dated, providing ameliorating information while skirting the irrelevant secrecies of the project. Please advise. Okay. <clears throat> so they don't like female staff. Oh, very old school. But I can hear bad things. I can hear terrible things. I think he's behind me. I don't want to look. Oh. Well, we got the key. Anyways, that, I mean, that's good. That's that's always a plus. Plus one. Yeah! Yeah! We opened the door. We got on that floor. Everybody walked to the dinosaur. Oh! Hey, room! You got any batteries? No, fuck off. Doing. Hey, 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 hey. Shit, I'm stuck in here. Gotta hit that again. Oh my god. I wonder if this is where that dude cooks his food. His door. Jesus! Criminy! Hello! Hi! Hey, old man Willikers! Can you not? Can you not? Yes! <laughs> Just don't? Yeah? Yeah? Okay. Oh? Stay there. And cook. Oh! Oh, no, I'd rather you just saw me out. Can, can we not? Can we not with the fire? Can we not with the fire? What am I- what am I meant to do? Okay, okay, there's a hole. Just hit the hole. Hit the hole. Three times. Four times, five times, six times, and seven times. Okay. Good. Oh. I'll be whatever you want me to be, baby. As long as it's not dead. If you want me to be dead? Oh, I can't help you with that one. I mean, I probably could help you with it. I just, I'd rather not. I'm gonna be honest with you, which I think. Honesty is what we've built our relationship upon, scary cannibal man. I think it would be wise to keep it that way. Oh! <laughs> what? Is this a church? Yeah, it must be. Oh, document! Yay! <clears throat> Preach the gospel! Far it be for me to la from me to I can't do that voice for all of this word. For all wow. Remind me never to record within two hours of myself waking up again. Far be it for me to lie to the man up to a man of God. So let me be at least say that I will do my personal best to improve the safety of your working conditions. I and the rest of the staff truly appreciate everything you do for our patients. And if you feel threatened by anybody in particular, simply let us know and we will either increase chemical restraints or administer a lobotomy or similar calming procedure. Don't underestimate the contribution your sermons offer our patients, especially considering the depth and necessarily chaotic nature of hypnotherapy. Our patients need to see the bedrocks of God and family. Not all of our poor for unfortunates have families to call upon, and so the burden and calling is yours. We are all... We are all of us relying on your faith and hard work. Well, that's just wonderful. At least, even if they're making the people crazy, at least they're trying to be a good people about it. At least they're trying to do something good with their lives. They're climbing the ladder now. Oh, 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 ho, ho, ho. I want, he told me to cook, so I better at least saute myself. I mean, come on. I can hear terrible things, and I, 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 I always want to look, but I really don't. Either way, we're going to be fine. Everything's going to work out for us, and we're going to be okay. Oh, wait. This is a prequel. We're going to die. Whoa. Blurry vision. What are you doing? Stop that. Ugh. Oh, this one's down, so we can go in here. 
Hello? Hello? Okay. These boxes are perfect. Oh, there's a battery. I want a battery? Alright, guys, in the next episode, we are going to go in there. Oh, dear. Um, this is pretty damn good for DLC so far. Like, I feel, I feel like I've already gotten my money's worth compared to a lot of other DLCs for really any game ever. Um, uh, sorry, I'm still, like, stretching. I haven't even, I didn't even stretch when I got up. I just kind of got up, turned on PS4 to go on Netflix, and then I was like, hey, what's up? It's Outlast. So anyways, guys, that's where I'm going to end this episode. I will see you all tomorrow. Hopefully you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye!